Hugo Chavez was first elected president of Venezuela in 1998. The former military commander rose to power from modest means to become one of the region's most popular yet divisive leaders. As president, Chavez vowed to end corruption and promised sweeping social reforms in education and health care. Over the years, he had been a vocal critic of US foreign policy and capitalism. On the world stage, he was a firebrand and at times unpredictable. Chavez didn't shy away from criticising foreign governments, angering Britain when he claimed the Falklands should be returned to Argentina. At the 2006 UN General Assembly, he told the audience the devil came here yesterday when referring to George W. Bush. He made the sign of the cross, saying he could even smell sulphur. In 2009, President Obama shook hands briefly with Chavez, signalling an attempt to improve strained relations between the US and Venezuela. He was never camera shy around other world leaders, meeting Russia's Vladimir Putin, Iran's Mahmoud Ahmadinejad and Syria's Bashar al-Assad. He also remained close friends with former Cuban dictator Fidel Castro and a staunch ally of Cuba. He met the actor Sean Penn several times, praising the Oscar winner for his humanitarian work. Chavez travelled to Cuba in 2011 for cancer treatment after a tumour was discovered in his pelvic region. Despite claiming to be cancer-free in July of last year, he was forced to undergo more cancer treatment for a fourth time in December. He returned to Caracas in February and his death was announced on March 5th, leaving a country in mourning and a government in turmoil.